you didn't say shape here. There's no way okay. that there's an H there, and there's no way that there's a P. Do you understand? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Cut and something. Stand. Cut and something. Cut and you stand. wrote. No. No, okay, listen to me. You wrote, remove two trees to ground level. That's what you wrote. Yes, ma'am. He didn't write that. He wrote his part, but he forgot to put down two trees. I asked him, as a reminder for me, we don't need to fill out a work order because it's only cut down two trees. Simple words, cut it down. I said, okay. So I asked him to write, as a reminder for me, his name and phone number, and cut and stack two trees. Cut he put and the Cut and stack. S-T. S-T-A-K. I, I, that, whatever, however he spells it is up to him. Well, it's however supposed to be he, S -T -A -C -K. he spells it is up to him. That's right. Tomato, what tomato. Does that mean? That's, I understand. He says that this word is shape, well, <laughs> which it's not. Mm -hmm. no, it's steak stack. is not. I can see stack. Yeah, it could have stack. I can see stack. Same you stack. could see stack? Yeah, because see, what he told me was he couldn't haul the, the branches away, so I told him he could stack them in the back, in the back of my property. Okay, I could Mr. Haul Gutier them off, Mr. But Gutierrez, he didn't want to pay that part. Mr. Gutierrez, my problem is you have to be really loony. Did you take these trees away? Just a second. Did you take these trees? They're huge trees. They're taller than the house. Did you remove them? Yes, ma'am. In your truck? No, no. I, I, I put them in the backyard. You put them in the backyard? He told me to cut them down and, and just uh, uh, stack them in the backyard. And I did exactly that. Your Honor, he told me it was going to cost more to take it to the dump and dump it. And he didn't have a trailer to put him in. So I told him he could stack them in the back so I can use them for firewood once they dry it. That's, that's, that's what that's about. Okay. Cut, just trim the trees, stack them in the back. Well, okay. the, your problem is I'm... not only did you miscommunicate, but you can't spell. Okay. <laughs> do you understand? Yes, I do, ma'am. You know, I feel Mr. Gutierrez cut down the two trees. He actually cut the stumps pretty close to the front, pretty close. I wish the people who did my tree work cut them so close. He did not grind out the stumps, which I assume that you have to take care of doing because that's a substantial amount of money. Have you done that? No, I have not. I got estimates, though, yeah, I'm for the trees. House actually doesn't look bad, sir. It Your actually Honor. doesn't look bad. I liked it better with the trees. It looked fuller with the trees, but it actually doesn't look bad. My problem, sir, is I'm totally sympathetic with you, but you miscommunicated to the defendant. He didn't do anything purposefully. You miscommunicated, and because what you wrote here is cut, and I don't know what, there's no shape there. Okay. There's no stack there. S-T-A-K-E. I don't know what right. that means with regard to trees. But it definitely says cut. It doesn't say prune. It doesn't. Right. When you prune trees, I mean, I do contracts, prune the four dogwood trees, prune the yellow maple tree. But you wrote in your own handwriting, I understand cut. That. Can I say something? All landscapers know Craig Myrtles, in January, February, March, you, cut, you, you trim them top. You cut the tops off two to three feet so that they can bloom in June. It's, it's understood. You have people what come. What do you mean it's understood? It wasn't understood 30, by Mr. Experience. Gutierrez. Now, I guarantee you, sir, Mr. Gutierrez worked a lot harder to cut down these two trees and schlep them into the backyard of your house than he would have if he just trimmed them. He gave you a quote. It was, he did more work. Mm -hmm. He did, It didn't do less work. He did more work. And it's because it's your responsibility as a homeowner to communicate with him in a reasonable fashion. Did you want to kill him? I wanted to kill Mr. Gutierrez, actually. I want to tell you something. Share it around a little bit. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Um, yeah, totally. Do you know how to spell the word shape? I do. Good. Your house doesn't look bad. You're going to have to plant new trees if you want new trees. Otherwise, get the stumps removed. It was a miscommunication. It was not negligent. And the miscommunication was yours, sir, because they were your trees. You should have communicated with them exactly what you wanted and put it on more than a piece of paper like this. He's the one who wrote it. What? No. He is... It's your tree. You have to communicate with the work person exactly what you want. And what you wrote here is cut. Yeah, but nobody, the tree. Cuts, nobody cuts trees. I, uh, experience, nobody, an, Mr. Gutierrez did. Uh, and that's his business. An experienced. Bye. All right, sir, excuse. You may step out. It's miscommunication. Nobody in their right mind will cut down a 30 year old tree. Communication is important. You know, I might have said cut, you just said cut. But God, come on. To me, cut it down means cut it down. I'll just hire a better guy next time. I'm not gonna let one bad apple ruin the whole bunch.